Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all doing well. I feel like I'm literally starting all my vlogs in my car at the moment. <laughs> it's just my my space of privacy, do you know? And I just feel like I can just say anything in my car. So <laughs> I've just pulled up to the gym. I'm literally, my pre-workout is matching my top today, my sports bra, which is brand new by the way. By the time that this video is up, um, these will all be launched, so I'm not sure if they will still be in stock, but it is a brand new like spotlight campaign. It's another She Who campaign, and it's literally got all these beautiful, like bright summer colours in it, and I don't know why the orange looks a little bit like muted on camera it's so much brighter in person it's literally like a bright orange this is called tangerine orange and then we've also got apple green uh, electric blue and then also grape purple and i'm literally obsessed with them all i feel like this is the first proper um like summer color drop that honor has done they've got a couple of summer colors but i feel like this is the first one where there's been actually quite a lot in one drop and i'm just so excited i just love a bright color in the gym so i'm really excited about this launch and yeah as i said it will have already gone live by the time this video is up so i do have my support link in the description if you want to kind of uh, check what's left i do get a lot of comments as well being like saying that my link doesn't get a discount and unfortunately my support link doesn't provide you guys a discount it just really helps to support me and my relationship with honor if you do shop through it and um, i wish it did give you a discount but it doesn't unfortunately but i just really really appreciate it if you guys shop through it because it does go a long way and i do earn a small amount of commission if you do shop through it so please let me know if you do so that i can thank you but today's video is gonna be a day in the life i'm gonna be gymming working and just on my grind today because i need to edit a full youtube video that i've just not had time to edit so i couldn't upload it for my sunday upload it will already be up by the time you guys watch this but um i just did not have time to upload it for my sunday 6 p.m upload which is really annoying but it is what it is. I'm going to try and get it up for tonight, which is Monday. But yeah, this is my whole gym fit, by the way. I'm wearing cool brown and orange, and I feel like these tones together are just chef's kiss. But I'm feeling so bloated today. I'm due on my period, and just feeling bloated. I do also need a wee, that's probably why. But yeah, my skin's breaking out. I feel bloated and tired, and yeah, I can just tell that i'm due on but i've not come on yet which is worrying but let's hope that's not what we think it is but yeah i just got to the gym i really 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 cannot be bothered i think it is because i'm due on like i just feel extra tired and i just cannot be bothered and like to be honest my body confidence is like not there today and i really wish i could just like put on a tracksuit but it's roasting in the uk i think we're having like a bit of a heat wave it's like getting up to 30 degrees it's 24 degrees now and it's just gone 10 a.m which is like really good for the uk so i did not want to put a tracksuit on i wish i could because i would normally just do that i'd put some joggers on or something but it's genuinely too hot first world problems but just telling you guys how i feel not every day is like you know feeling your best and like on days like this it makes me kind of like not want to film and it just literally makes me want to go in put my headphones on and focus on my session but i do want to film it for you especially for my youtube as well just because it's just a bit of reality i guess training when you are due on and not putting too much pressure on yourself you know to be lifting weights that you normally do when you're maybe not due on because it really does like your cycle really does affect like how you are performing in the gym and I feel like more women should know about it and I don't know I just feel like it's really important because I feel like with women it's obviously a lot different to men I'm not saying that men you know like have it easy or whatever but I feel like obviously men do do not have like a cycle and their kind of strength and everything like that they just like feel the same throughout the entire month whereas girls have 
different stages of their cycles where like your body is affected differently so yeah training can be i feel like training is just very very different throughout the month you know throughout the four weeks five weeks that is your cycle and it's completely normal and i think i said this in my previous video but i do recommend starting to maybe track your cycle getting something to track it just so that you are aware of changes in your body and you're not kind of beating yourself up about maybe not feeling as good and you're not kind of wondering why you don't feel as good because a few months ago i never like tracked anything and i would be kind of like confused as to why i would maybe feel tired at this time and then i'd come on my, pe on my period and be like oh that's why but when i didn't know i would kind of beat myself up about it and be like oh you know you just you just beat yourself up about it don't you but if you kind of go into certain weeks knowing what to expect it's easier to kind of relieve some pressure off yourself but anyway i'm gonna stop blabbing i do need to finish my pre-workout which ehp labs summer sale is still on by the way if you guys haven't got yourself any supplements you can use my code mia and that will get you up to 60 percent off but yeah so stretch marks are absolutely popping stretch marks are popping at the moment Do you know what i've realized that i've got lots and lots of stretch marks on my bum and like around my legs since bulking and i really like it because it just shows me kind of how much i have grown in that time and I personally like it i don't see a problem with it just chatting shit now so i'm gonna go train and i will take you along on my session I told you every single time don't you worry you would always call me at the wrong time so you can know what i was up to oh don't you get that it's just stupid just finished at the gym got a sick pump that was actually a really good session um i feel like i was just 
feel like I was just in the zone. And it was kind of like one of them ones where I really didn't want to train, but once I was in there, I was just I was just really enjoying myself. So that's just great, but it's so warm. It's apparently it's only 24 degrees. Surely not. Well, apparently it's only 24 degrees. It feels feels like 30. But I'm gonna head home and have some dinner. I'm gonna have my latest obsession. Truffle pasta tuna salad. I don't know why I said it in that order, that was so random. But honestly, obsessed with it. I'm sure I'll be sick of it soon, but I'm not just yet. So I showed you how to make it, I think, in one of my recent videos. So I don't think I'll um, show you how to make it this time. But yeah, I'm gonna have that and then I'm gonna head to Starbucks. I've got so much work to do. And also need to do some research for something really exciting that could be taking place within the next few weeks, if not the next couple of months. And I'm honestly so excited. So I'm gonna get some work done and do that in Starbs. I feel like Starbs on a sunny day is just a vibe it's just a vibe and I'm just I feel like a change of scenery is just needed at the minute okay guys this is the Starbucks fit that I've changed into it is the honor active varsity collection and it's literally just the perfect like set for this kind of weather it's so comfortable but it's also obviously so lightweight it's like a mesh material it's literally just the perfect summer fit also got the slides on and got my flask but yeah I'm gonna go and be a busy bee I've got a lot to do today Right guys, I've just finished in Starbucks. I am just about to drive home and I honestly just need to finish off editing this YouTube video and actually get it uploaded. The Wi-Fi in Starbucks is not amazing, so I'm not really gonna try and upload it in there. But I do also need to make some calls for this thing that's exciting that's happening really soon and like book some things in. Um, I just don't wanna say anything about it too yet. It's nothing like really, well, it's quite private, but it's nothing like major. I will obviously update you guys and like fill you guys in with what it is like when it's gone through and everything like that. I just don't want to like jinx it and say it out loud just yet, but I'm really excited to tell you and yeah, just really excited. So I need to go home and make some calls with regards to that. It's only three o'clock now, so I've still got quite a while. The sun is shining, it's now 29 degrees beautiful if you ask me absolutely roasting in this car that is gonna be me for a little while and i'll catch up with you guys soon oh. <laughs> look at this little boy waiting for his tea is it tea time yeah it is <laughs> it's tea time where's your bowl Go Moo Moo. Good boy. Right, I've just come into our garden room. It's so cute in here, especially in summer. It's just proper, it's proper cosy vibes though. It's proper like these are all fairy lights and stuff and it's really cosy. But when it's nice weather, it's unreal. But I just need to make some calls and I need to do it now because places are gonna close soon. It's nearly four o'clock. So yeah, that is gonna be me for the next while.
some very successful calls and now i'm just gonna do some editing while i'm sat here although it is very hot in here it's kind of like a greenhouse but i mean views on views on views so i guess it's worth it just making some tea i'm making chicken halloumi potatoes and a little bit of veg the sun is still beaming and it's what time is it half six so that's just great but yeah i'm making tea and then we're gonna chill Right guys, I'm all showered, got the pyjamas on, and I'm just watching Sophia and Chinsia's new video. But guys, oh my gosh, look how cute this dressing gown is that I just got the other day. It's from Jerf Avenue, I think that's how you say it. It's Matilda Jerf's brand, I don't even know if that's how you say the name, but honestly, nicest dressing gown ever. The stuff on the website is actually pretty spenny, but it's such good quality, and I also got a little matching... Um, headband thing for when I do my makeup but I'm gonna end this video here guys I'm literally just gonna chill for the rest of the night had a pretty productive day and I'm happy with what I got done so yeah just gonna chill for the rest of the night also me and Anton have been watching this series on Apple TV it's, it's hardly a series it's only six episodes but it's on Apple TV and it's called Blackbird and it's basically about this like famous serial killer called Larry Hall and it's kind of like Jeffrey Dahmer how they've made it into like an actual real thing rather than the real guy speaking they've got like an actor doing it and stuff and it's really really good because there's kind of like I don't know I don't want to spoil it but it's just really it's just really good we've not finished it yet and um, we've got a couple episodes left and we're just about to get to the good part so yeah highly recommend if you've got Apple TV Go give it a watch. Who remembers Regina? Regina Falange. She keeps getting decagged somehow and I don't know how. She's not at the moment. I've, I've made her look appropriate. But I just wake up in the morning and she's decagged and it's a bit, bit of a weird thing from Regina. Don't know if it, I don't know if he's Dexter. De Dexter, are you decagging Regina in the night? <laughs> Anyway, yeah, I'm going to end this video here. I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.